The only thing I want to say to the black athletes who participated in those games illegally is that I wish you 14 years of leg trouble. Oh. <laughs> All we want to say is that we don't have a big speech. We want to let the United States of America, we want to let the whole world know that we are going to pick our heroes from today on. There's been so many white people telling me that I was a fool and I was standing up on that platform alone. Tommy Smith and I were alone. And I was very honored and pleased to come home to the black community and find that everyone was there with us. Thank you. I didn't believe in the national anthem, but I stood up anyway because I didn't want no static. But those days are gone. You'll never see me stand up and tell this thing, national anthem represents me. Right, on. right, right on. now, it doesn't represent me. And I want you to know another thing. The United States booed and harassed Tommy Smith and myself, and I think we did it the best way we could possibly do. If things don't change by 72, you can believe they're going to be running around a flaming stadium. <laughs> because we're going to say that. Considered them heroes. Upon their return, they were honored at special Brother ceremonies Harry at Howard Harry. University in Washington. And black power advocate Stokely Carmichael expressed the sentiment of many black Americans. Oh, we want to... Please back up some more. Please back up. 